you just uh, see your home all ripped up or some have seen their homes in water and it's just devastating because that's where you have your family, you have a lot of memories. In the wake of Hurricane Sandy's devastating blow to the Northeast, one of the hardest hit yet less publicized areas is Little Egg Harbor, New Jersey. Damage in this small community was among the worst in the affected areas. When the cry went out to help families in this crisis, Operation Blessing answered the call. It's such a little tucked away little town um, that almost, I don't want to say forgotten, but almost a little forgotten town because they haven't had really anybody else in here to help them. People here weren't allowed back into their homes for days after the storm. When they returned to see what was left of their homes, they needed help clearing out damaged walls, furniture, and lifelong memories. And most of all, they wanted to salvage whatever they could. That's where Operation Blessing volunteers came in. Before they even, you know, throw anything out, they ask me, they double ask me. Um, very, very professional and very, you know what, the caring and the kindness that they are displaying is just unbelievable, wonderful. They even told me, oh, thank you for letting me come in your house. And it was like, oh, thank you for being here. The feeling I got, the only thing I could honestly think of, it was like it was raining angels. This means an awful lot to me. I will never forget it. They're uh, cordial, they're kind. They've really been uh, protective, like you have a friend. Uh, in this case today, I have many. With your help, Operation Blessing will continue to meet the needs of those affected by Hurricane Sandy and others who have met unforeseen tragedies around the world. All you folks that have donated, God bless you all. And I mean, it's the best thing that you could have ever donated to. It's the kind of organization you want to support because they do help people. We see that. We see that firsthand.